Hello! I know, it's been an age, hasn't it? Well, it's Saturday the 28th of September, uh, 2019, of course, um, for posterity. Um, <clears throat> and it's autumn, you might, uh, you might notice here. So I'm just down at the garden to, um, collect a few things. I mean, everything's really done, but I had some lettuce here, and I'll show you in a bit, uh, I pulled up the Canada goose beans. That, now they're a drying bean. They don't look like much, but uh, yeah, let me just uh, show you the garden here. Borage. There we are. No pollinators though, <laughs> but you're still flowering like a trooper. So there'll be lots of seeds in this area for next year. Um, yeah, pretty mucky. You see the black clay soil. It's so beautiful and so, so nutritious for this vegetables that we grow. Um, I've got a little bit of uh, dill. I'll be taking some of that and some parsley today. That's the, uh, the large dill there. I um, just wanted to show you. I've pulled some lettuce. It's in the back of the truck now. Uh, yeah, I mean, there's ice. There is ice on the ground. There's a spinach over there, I just noticed. My goodness. You can see there's a little bit of ice there. I don't know if you can see that. Yep. Yeah. Um, two nights of good frost. Minus three, that kind of thing. Um, the lettuce doesn't even phase them. They're nice and close to the ground. Now here's the parsnips. I'm going to leave these another week. I want them to get a few more frosts, um, and I don't have to pull them until the 14th of the latest of October, that is. Um, yeah, uh, and then the garden will be closed, and all of these structures that people have around will have to be taken out, uh, ready for winter. Um, we leave a lot of this, uh, this green matter down. Oh, wow, somebody had some radishes, I think, maybe, or those beautiful radish seeds there. Yes, they look like radishes. They got quite tall. Uh, yeah, so that's it. That's it for uh, 2019. It's over. Done. Oh, look at those beautiful trees there. So, there's my parsley. I've got some lettuce. Nice bag full. Nice shopping bag full. And then we've got our dill, and these are the Canada goose beans. I just not a lot there. They didn't uh, really germinate well for me, but uh, that looks like seed for next year. So we'll try again. I like the kind of mottled bean. I think they're called Canada goose because the actual bean inside is uh, speckled and uh, like a goose egg. There you go. All right, so I'm going to head home now, scrape the muck off my boots, and uh, yeah. Next time uh, I'm here, I'll be digging out the parsnips. All the best. Thanks for joining me.